Where are you? What happened, Mohan? Look, Mom, I have another tooth broken. In the past few months, I have lost three teeth. Now, when I laugh, my face looks so funny. I do not want to look like this. <laughs> Mohan, these are your milk teeth. After some time, you will get new and permanent teeth in place of your broken teeth. Friends, like Mohan, you must have also lost your milk teeth and got your new permanent teeth. You know that teeth are an important part of our body. They help us to chew and eat our food. They also help us to speak clearly. Do you know that a kid can have maximum 20 milk teeth? However, when he grows up, he will have maximum 32 permanent teeth. Let us learn more about our teeth. When you look at your teeth in the mirror, you will notice that the teeth in your mouth are of different shapes and sizes. We have four different types of teeth. Each type of teeth has a different purpose. Cut, tear, grind and chew. Let us see the front four teeth in both the upper and lower jaws. They all are same in shape and have a sharp edge. They work like scissors to bite or cut food into small pieces. Hence they are called incisors. Look at the sharp pointed teeth located on both sides of incisors on each jaw. These are used to tear the food like a fork. They are called canines. They are four in number, two in each jaw. Next to each canine, there are two broad and flat teeth. They act as nutcracker and are used to grind and break the food into fine pieces. They are called premolars. They are four premolars in each jaw. Look at the last three teeth on both sides of each jaw. On both sides of each jaw, the last three teeth are broader than the premolars. These are called molars. Their function is similar to the premolars, but they are used to grind the food further into a fine paste. We have in total 32 teeth, 16 in each jaw. Now let us learn about the structure of a tooth. The body of a tooth is divided into two parts. The upper part is called crown, while the lower part is called root. The root is fixed in jaw and is hidden. The crown is made up of enamel, which is the hardest material in our body. Below the enamel, there is a bone-like material called cementum or dentine. Cementum helps to fix each jaw firmly into the jawbone. The center of the tooth is known as pulp. The root portion of each tooth is surrounded by the gums, that also cover the jawbone. The pulp and gums have blood vessels and nerves. Teeth Our teeth help to break the food we eat into smaller pieces so that we can swallow and digest it properly. Teeth play an important role and so it is very important to take good care of our teeth. In today's module, let us learn about how to take care of our teeth. When we eat something, Little bits of food get stuck in the places between the teeth. These bits remain in the mouth even long after a meal is over. Now let us look closer to see what happens to this leftover food. Tiny living things called germs start feeding on this food and start producing acid. This acid can cause holes in the teeth, called cavities, which cause pain and make it 
difficult for us to eat our favorite dishes. So, how to prevent cavities? It's simple. Brushing our teeth properly can help us keep them clean and healthy. We must brush our teeth twice a day. Once in the morning, after getting up, and once at night, before going to bed. For proper cleaning, you must brush your teeth for at least two minutes. Start by cleaning the outer surface of all the teeth by up and down and circular movements of the brush. Then open your mouth wide and start by cleaning the inner surface of the teeth of the lower and upper jaw with back and forth strokes. Now clean the biting surfaces of the teeth with back and forth stroke of the brush. Then rinse your mouth properly with water and make sure that you do not swallow the toothpaste. But it is not just brushing that will keep your teeth healthy. You also need to be careful about what you eat and drink. The germs in the mouth love sugary food, like sweets and colas, so you should avoid having too much of these items. Eat lots of fruits and vegetables and rinse your mouth after each meal. Visit a dentist for a dental checkup once a year. And also, if you feel any discomfort in any tooth. Healthy eating habits help to keep the teeth fit and strong for a longer time. Eat healthy and fiber-rich food for breakfast, lunch and dinner. Drink at least six glasses of water every day. Eat different kinds of food during the day. Remember to brush properly and eat healthy for shiny and strong teeth.